Hello, my name is Wayne Hodges. I'm from Deland, Florida. Uh, been around motocross, race motocross my whole life. Uh, my daughter is 10 years old. She's been around motocross her whole life and uh, uh, been racing since she's six. And you know, it's our life. And uh, uh, this lead ban law, the lead laws come out, and uh, just really disappointing. You know that it's a, uh, it's having effect on something that we love, something we enjoy doing. Um, Right away, it affected us. We had a motorcycle uh, that seized, and uh, we had difficulty getting parts. And uh, you know, I, I I understand the lead law, and I actually uh, support it. But it doesn't apply to dirt bikes. It just uh, it's it's totally unfair. It's not what the law is meant to be, and it needs to be resolved uh, immediately. I mean, when I first heard of the law, I assumed that it'd be something that'd be a week, maybe two weeks, and it'd be handled. But uh, it's uh, affected numerous people that I know. I have many friends that are in the bike business, many friends that are, you know, that's how they make their living, and it makes up a pretty good percentage of uh, what they sell each month. And um, these bikes here have been pulled off the floors. Uh, you know, they're, they're no longer allowed to sell them. And uh, very disappointing. Uh, I hope that, that we get the right people to represent us and get this law, law taken care of immediately. Thank you. And it looks like the MXC riders going into turn number one. Everybody gets out of there clean, ladies and gentlemen. We are underway here, race number nine here at MX of Marion County.